Hey there everybody, it's Jessica and Peanut here and today we wanted to join you for a short and sweet standing stretch routine. So whether you've just finished a workout or maybe you're just feeling a little stiff in the middle of your day, this standing series will hopefully help you stretch out some stress, relieve some tension and tightness in your muscles and help you feel a little bit better. So we're just going to start with this feet a little bit wider than hip width apart and let's just breathe for a moment. Taking a nice deep breath in, stretching your arms up towards the sky, spreading your fingers wide, inhaling as deeply as you can, and then exhale, just let it all out. Let's try that again one more time, even deeper with the breath, inhaling, and exhale, relax, good. We all want to try to take on the spirit of Peanut and be as relaxed as she is. So from here, let's just take one ear over to one shoulder. Take it over to the other side. Come back to the center, looking down towards the floor. And up towards the ceiling. Come to the center. Just look as far as you can to one side. And go the other way. Nice. Coming back to the center, let's take one more deep breath in. And as you exhale, we're going to bend the knees, bringing the hands on top of the thighs, sitting back in the hips, taking a nice little spine stretch in a standing cat cow. So tuck the tailbone, bring your chin up and towards your chest. Inhale. Exhale, drop the belly towards the floor, arch, and try to look up. Again, inhaling, rounding, just working through that spine. Exhale, arch. One more time, inhale, round. And exhale, release. Good, let's slowly roll up through the back, rolling up, stacking the spine, standing nice and tall at the top. Good, let's step the back foot forward, coming into a nice, solid stance with the feet. Reaching both hands behind you, if you can, interlace your fingers together, roll your shoulders back and down, lift your heart, take a deep breath. Just taking a moment to stretch, to open the body, to breathe deeply. Take both hands out in front of you, interlace your fingers, turn your palms away, and just round across your upper back, dropping your chin towards your chest. Coming in towards the center, take one arm up and over, and the other way, up and over, and the other way. Let's face the other direction, taking that standing cat-cow stretch again, inhaling the arms up. Exhale, sit back in your hips. See if maybe you can move a little bit more through the spine. Inhale, rounding, rounding, rounding. Exhale, big arch. Again, inhale, round. Exhale, big arch. Once more, inhale, round. Exhale, arch. Rolling all the way up to standing. Stepping that back foot forward, finding that solid stance with our legs. Let's start with the upper back first this time. Interlace your fingers round across that upper back. Just really think of pushing the palms away from you, stretching across your shoulder blades, behind your shoulder blades. Taking both hands back behind you, interlace the fingers if you can. Inhale and lift. Just breathe, relax. Good, and moving on from here, so we're gonna keep the split stance. Put your weight in your back leg, flex your front toes, and just hinge from your hips. Now you might feel a stretch right here. Make sure you don't push on top of your knee. Hands should be above your thighs. If you could reach your foot, you could gently pull back on your toes. And if you have your balance, you could also try a reach. So you could be here or here. Let's release it, come back to the center, release that leg, shift your weight forward, 
tapping the back toe. If you have something you can hold on to for balance, go for it. See if you could bring your heel up towards your body and press your pelvis forward. You could use one hand, you could use two hands. Of course, you can also hold on to something if you need help finding your balance. And one more here before we turn the other direction. Take that back foot back to the floor. Bend your back knee, but keep your heel in contact with the floor. Take a little stretch. Getting into the Achilles and the calves. Straighten it out and let's just rotate the other way. Coming back to that split stance, shifting your weight back, flexing the front foot, hinging forward, spine is nice and long. So again, you can stay here. You could try reaching here and or add a rotation and hold. So just going to the, your own degree with every pose, seeing what feels best for you. Slowly release, come up, shift your weight forward, hold on to something if needed. See if you've grabbed that back foot, one or two hands, pressing the hips forward, stretching across the front of the thigh, up into the hip flexor. Deep breaths. And just one more here, putting that back foot down, heel to the floor, bend your back knee. Good, and turning it to the center, getting into our inner and outer thighs. Feet are wide. Just bend this knee, keep this leg extended, both hands on that bent leg on top of the knee, meaning on the thigh, not on top of the kneecap. Come on up, go to the other side. Good, so this is just a great standing series. Maybe you just finished some cardio, maybe you just went for a run or a long walk. Maybe you're just somewhere you just don't want to get on the floor right now. Let's do one more here, crossing this leg behind, bending the front knee, pushing into the hip, stretching out and through the side. Deep breaths. Good. Come on up, change your leg out. Bend that front knee, leaning into the hip, stretching away. Coming center, take a nice deep breath in. Bring your palms together and just keep pressing through the palms. Let's stretch to the wrists and the forearms to finish. Stretch it side and side. Circling the wrists, take a nice deep breath in to finish up here. And release it. Good, thank you so much for joining us for this quick standing stretch series. Hopefully you're feeling a little bit more relaxed, a little bit more stretched out. If you'd like to continue to work on your flexibility, we have a ton more stretching videos here on our channel, as well as other cardio, strength, coordination, all kinds of stuff. We'd always love to join you for another workout anytime. Thanks so much for tuning in with us today. Peanut and I look forward to joining you for another session soon. Take care, everybody.